Welcome back to Single Player Party. It's been a while since I've made some videos, but you know, it's been a very busy summer and lots of normal work stuff. So I wanted to make a video where I show you some things that I've picked up at the Dollar Tree. And I have seen them available online sometimes too, but a couple board game accessories that I love. And there's some cool stuff there, so you gotta check out the Dollar Store. This is my favorite thing that I've found there in a long time. I've got, it looks like this, hopefully it doesn't, yep, it is a tube for, I think like a vinyl holder, hold your vinyl, and it's called a retractable holder, and I buy them for my gaming mats, so... It's the Crafter's Square retractable holder. And it's a little tight for any oversized playmats, but all your normal like Magic the Gathering sized playmats, it um, fits them all really, really good. So um, there's a smaller size and a larger size, and it doesn't make them any longer, really. Um, this one extends up to... 14.375 inches and the other one's 14.5 and the extension isn't really that much like you know a, just over a tenth of an inch so that's not like a big deal but it can handle thicker mats so there's a little bit of a size and these are a dollar 25 like actual play mat holders are a lot more expensive they come with a little you know leash wrist leash so that's great goes in my backpack really well and also um for these i have one of those vinyl wall racks um for where i uh slot them all in and it the vinyl the plastic that covers the play mats only goes like you know for about that much of them and this is cool because this protects them all the way through and so I have way too many play mats and uh, I bought like 20 of these so it's like less than 30 bucks and it protects like my favorite 20 play mats or whatnot so I got these like four to six months ago and I bought a ton of them and they keep restocking them at Dollar Tree and I don't I haven't checked the online website in the last couple of weeks but they were on there and then another thing I like to grab over there is from the little food section is um these little tubs it's 10 tubs for a dollar 25 and these are awesome for separating tokens inside my boxes for my games so i've got hundreds of these <laughs> yeah hundreds and hundreds and i so whenever i punch a game i'll have some of these and i'll separate the tokens and then if they if these can fit back in the box like some boxes can't fit a bunch of little boxes then I'll use my little baggies I got but um, you know how so many boxes come with so much filler space these help take up the space and so you get a I get a little box and so they also have I don't have one handy but you can buy a like a crayon box a little plastic crayon box you can put cards in there and so everything's staying organized even when it's jumbling around without an organizer and then the last thing that's kind of uh, situational for the season it's more seasonal than situational are these little like um, cork bottles that are just you know decorations for Halloween there's orange gray purple and I think brown and um, I like inside here I've got some Star Wars figures from a Star Wars game and um, a set of polyhedrals and you can just fill these up with dice. They look cool. They decorate really well. And um, you know, I haven't stuffed these in a game in a game box yet, but you totally could. But I I prefer these just on my desk. Um, it looks doesn't look as cool with all the little figures in there. But you fill this up with dice, and it looks amazing. So I just want to really recommend the Dollar Tree. Uh, if you have one near you, go in because there's a lot of stuff. Uh, these tubes are in the craft section. This is in the food section. Uh, you can get some other like four for a dollar, thicker, stronger ones. 
but like for little tokens i don't need them to be that strong and the other ones are a lot bigger so if the box is small or a thin profile for the box for the board games um those can be too big so the box won't close or they won't fit with the inserts like the inserts that come with them so that's that and then this is in the halloween section right now and these sell out fast i traveled around to a bunch of different last year i traveled around to a bunch of different um dollar trees to get to make sure i got all the different colors and i bought like a, you know a bunch of different ones of that so i just wanted to share some uh pickups for um board game accessories so go check out the dollar tree and if you don't have one near you they do have online stores i think the thing is you have to buy it like a case but for something like this totally worth it if you got a lot of play mats if you only have like five play mats maybe not that great but if you're crazy like me and you've got 100 play mats um it's awesome you know buying a case online even with the shipping i mean the cheapest tube you're gonna find for like protecting your play mats maybe four to five dollars at most of the time i see them for like eight to twelve so you know with shipping on these you're getting probably for like two bucks each if you buy the case uh, it's such a good deal. So hopefully that helps you out and I've got more gameplay coming. So I'll be doing some more gameplay. I'm going <laughs> to, I want to jump back into uh, legacy of dragon Holt, and then I'm learning the campaign mode for, uh, a game. Oh, I'm just going to make a mess. Um, agent Decker. I've been wanting to play card games, so I want to play through the Agent Decker game, so that one will be coming soon, too. All right. Well, I hope you like these. If you end up finding these or finding something else there or at a different store, let me know. And um, please, if you pick this stuff up, tell me you, tell me you grabbed it. I want to I wanna hear that um, somebody picked up something from a recommendation.